Hello, and welcome to one of my mini emulation tutorial videos. We'll be setting up Fusion to play Sega Genesis, also known as the Mega Drive, on a Windows PC. As usual, all links and instructions will be in the description for your convenience. First, we need to get some software before moving on to the emulator itself. This includes 7-zip, and an MD file of the game you want to play, or one of these formats listed on the screen. There may also be more extensions that could work. You will also need graphics drivers for AMD, NVIDIA, or Intel depending on your graphics processor, and C++ redistributables. You can find links to all of those in the description. If you don't know which graphics drivers you need, just let me know so I can help you with that. If you don't know how to use 7-zip, click to the upper right to find out how. A quick note, downloading the game is illegal so I won't be showing you that. If you decide to take that route, however, googling for it is usually pretty easy. To be clear though, you do need the game in some format, like ROM or MD. If you want to obtain the game legally, look in the primary links section of the description for a link that should help you out. You do need to use your own game to use that method. Once you're finished with all of that, type in this URL or go to the description for a link to download the emulator. Click on the link of Kega Fusion 3.64 for Windows. Now go to your downloads folder. Right click on the zip file, hover over 7-zip, and click extract here. You can choose to make a dedicated folder like I do here, but it's not needed. Double click on Fusion to open the application. Now we need to set up the controller. Go to Options, Set Config, and click on the Controllers tab. Next, in order to use your controller, click here to get a drop-down menu if you want to choose a gamepad. Now click on Define. In the bottom, it tells you which keys to use for each button. The next key or button you press will be bound to that button. Once you're done with that, click Apply and OK. Make sure to have your game file ready to use. Now go to File, Load Genesis ROM, select the game you're wanting to play, and click Open. Your game should have started. If you want to know how to get better graphics, stick around for a quick graphical configuration tutorial. For better graphics, go to Video, Full Screen Resolution, and go to the very bottom. If you have any video plugins, which you'd need to download and put in the directory folder, go to Video, and they should be in the Render Plugins section as shown right here. While in Video, you might want to try the Brighten option to see if you prefer that as well. Another thing you can do is go to the Options and uncheck Show FPS if you don't want to see the FPS counter in the lower left. That's not really a graphical change, it just gets rid of the FPS counter. And that's all for this tutorial. If you have any issues, let me know in the comments and I might be able to help. Otherwise, if you're interested in more tutorial videos, make sure to click on those in the outro or check out my channel to find more. And always remember to have fun.